Hello, beautiful XRP Army. Welcome to my new channel, my new uh, segment. I'm just going to go through some news. It's a hell of a XRP news day, uh, February 18th, 2022. It's nighttime, so I got to see all the news going on and just kind of inspired me to make this segment. Um, we got a lot of whale moves uh, going to Coinbase. Got whale alerts. Uh, let's see, we had 40 million XRP going to Coinbase, another 40. Let's see, there was at least one or two more. So it was a good amount. Uh, there's another 20 million XRP going to Bitstamp. Um, you know, the rumor mill is swirling. Uh, none of this is financial advice. None of this is, I'm not a financial advisor and uh, do your own research before investing. Uh, this is for information only. Uh, another whale alert right there. And I think there were four of them. But anyway, you can do your own research on that. But yeah, there's a lot of uh, XRP moving around out there today. Uh, yeah, here it is. There's the big one. Uh, 89 million XRP uh, from unknown wallet to unknown wallet. So I think that was the four big ones. So a lot of movements today. Um, kind of caught wind of that from you dot today. And uh, yeah, a couple of and the whale alerts. So that's pretty interesting stuff. Let's see more mega whales uh, scooping up. So this is all stuff you can look at um, from Coin Telegraph. Uh, about 700 million worth of XRP since December. Interesting read there. So go read that. Um, also, Stasis is a Euro stablecoin issuer that uh, has come out and said that they're going to issue one on the XRP ledger, which was very interesting and not that expected. And I don't see uh, it covered very widely but uh yeah please share this around and so we can get the word out about all this interesting stuff that i've been studying all day today like an obsessed person but it's a lot of fun very interesting stuff going on um also some sec uh you know ripple case jeremy hogan the attorney puts on a great uh great update for us so go check that out i'll leave a link in the description um, and he thinks the sec might have made a blunder in their case regarding the hinman speech kind of kind of looks like they're flip-flopping on that so yeah it's interesting a lot of news today um Sologenic has released their nft marketplace if you guys and gals and others are into nfts and if you don't know, Sologenic is a pretty new decentralized exchange. Um, the Solo Coin, not financial advice. And but yeah, it's a decentralized exchange. It's pretty cool. You can connect your Zoom wallet or Zoom wallet, however you say that. And uh, yeah, you can trade. Um, you know, you can get trust line. Put your trust lines in. I think through this. I haven't uh, traded on this one yet. Um, so uh, that's something to research. It's new, so, you know, give it a research. Um, XR Dog had a big uh, Telegram auction. So congrats to them. About 54 million was sold. That's pretty cool stuff. Um, that Sologenic uh, decentralized exchange, they're actually trying to they're uh, in the works and thinking about, uh, I guess they're working on it. This is like an open source project that they're working on. Um, and it's uh, going to be like a first layer blockchain where they um, basically they have, they want to use some features that the XRP ledger can't offer them. So they're kind of going back to the drawing board and um I think it's, I'm going to do a whole video on this coin, but it's the core coin and uh, they're going for speed and transactions per second. 
Um, but yeah, I'll, I'll go over this, but it's interesting. The Sologenic team is doing this and it's open source and it's based on WebAssembly, which is an interesting new technology that's pretty new where browsers can compile code and make it run very fast as if it's a uh, native app on, uh, and it's interoperable across machines. So um, this is an interesting project uh, to look at. And uh, I think they're airdropping to solo holders. So that's something to look at and research as well. And then I came across these three interesting sites. Um, XRPL Coins, this is a tracker, ledger tracker, and it's a decentralized exchange. Um, so this is another one to research. And, you know, do your own re research on these ones. I, I haven't really vetted them. I'm just kind of providing them uh, as is, you know, just kind of check them out. And, you know, there's a lot of new projects popping up for the XRP ledger. Um, but they have a good, you know, they have featured coins and then they have like a list of, um, I think they have, you know, you can find, there it is, view all XRP coins. So that's a good way to dig deep into the prices of what's going on. Solo's at about 50, Casino Coin, about, uh, what's that, a tenth, you know, tenth of a penny. Uh, ELS is about 6.4, XOR DOG, and so you can find, you know, you can find whatever's trending. And then uh, this uh, project on XRP, they're, they're kind of going for a lot of stuff. They're doing, they're trying to do a uh, pay for, uh, pay for play kind of gaming thing. And they're trying to, you know, get their fingers in a lot of projects, which is, Pretty cool, but uh, you know it's a little risky. But this is a a pretty new, is almost brand new project to check out. But I thought their education section was pretty cool. They had some good articles that you can uh, read and educate yourself. And down here, yeah, good stuff for uh, you know learning about trust lines, escrows, and uh, all that stuff. So that's a good one. And this one, I've been, this one's one of my favorite new coins on the dex.live. And I did a full video on this, so check it out. But uh, yeah, you can find, this is just another XRP ledger. Uh, you know, you can check it out, what do you, whatever they call it, an inspector or, um, but yeah, we can go through some coins. Uh, it's, this is another new project. So they got solo here at 39. Uh, let's see, we can find the, uh, there's some trending NFT ones going on to ELS is at five cents. XR Dog had a spike, kind of calmed down. Uh, the 3D Apes going ape. Uh, yeah, it's been having a run. You know, big uptrend there. And let's see, there's a couple others that are trending. Reaper coins at five cents. The X zombies, zombies are yeah, trending as well. A big spike lately, that's just since uh, February 6th, 7th or so. So they had their big, they've had a big run. And that's an NF, that's another NFT uh, coin, I think. Actually, I know it is. Yes, it, I know it is. Um, so I think that's about all I wanted to cover today. A lot of stuff going on. Pretty exciting news. Um, oh, got a goblin coin kind of going off here. That sounds NFT-like. Whoa, that's quite the spike. So, yes. Lots of spikes going on lately. <clears throat> and XOGE. Got some chaos going on here. But uh, yeah, uptrending up for them too. And like I said, none of this is financial advice. I just think it's interesting that we can look right on the ledger and on these uh, 
on these sites that are popping up and uh, they're doing some good work for us. So support them in any way you can. I, this one's free. I think you can donate to them. I'm not uh, affiliated with any of these sites. This is just uh, information from me to you. Maru. Got Maru coin spiking as well. Looks brand new. All right. Um, all right. That's all I wanted to share today. Uh, give me a like. Give me a subscribe. Share this video around social, around Reddit and Twitter and all that good stuff. And uh, I'm usually under uh, Crypto J Bro on Twitter. And uh, let's see, on Reddit, I'm Jared B136. So if you want to hit me up with uh, XRP news and stuff like that, I'll be deep diving and pretty much uh, dedicated to that uh, for the next uh, next foreseeable future. And uh, thanks for watching. I appreciate it.